This is how we can draw a pressure volume curve within Hamilton G5. We go on Tools and then choose the PV tool. Here the machine reminds you that you can generate a PV curve only under controlled modalities and that the ventilation will be inactive for 5 breaths after the start of the maneuver. Ok, so first we set the pressure where we want the PV curve to start. Then we choose the ramp speed as low as possible. And then the P top which we put to a level that we consider safe for the patient. 40 in this case. And then we can start. Here I speed it up a little bit. And here we have it. So we go with the cursor 1 to find our lower inflection point. Here we are, it is 14 in our case. And then we cursor 2, we look for the upper inflection point, which is 26 in our case. So with this tool, we would choose a peep higher than the lower inflection point in order to keep open the recruited areas and the plateau pressure lower than the upper inflection point to avoid over detention. 